The Carrington Event Earth's Electronic Apocalypse The Carrington Event, also known as the Carrington Flare or the Solar Storm, was a powerful geomagnetic storm that occurred in 1859. It was named after the British astronomer Richard Carrington, who observed and recorded the solar flare that triggered the event. One morning, Richard Carrington was capturing the likeness of an enormous group of sunspots. Suddenly, he saw two brilliant beads of blinding white light appeared over the sunspots, intensified rapidly, and became kidney-shaped. Realizing that he was witnessing something unprecedented and being somewhat flurried by the surprise, Carrington later wrote, I hastily ran to call someone to witness the exhibition with me. On returning within one minute, I was mortified to find that it was already much changed and enfeebled. Just before dawn the next day, skies all over planet Earth erupted in red, green, and purple auroras so brilliant that newspapers could be read as easily as in daylight. The most visible effect of the Carrington event was the appearance of auroras in unusual locations. They were seen over Cuba, the Bahamas, Jamaica, El Salvador, and Hawaii. Now question is that what is solar flare? And how it affected the Earth? Solar flare is a sudden and intense burst of radiations from the sun's surface. This solar flare was accompanied by a coronal mass ejection, which is a massive release of solar plasma and magnetic fields into space. In the 19th century, telegraph systems were the primary means of long-distance communication. The geomagnetic storm induced powerful electrical currents in telegraph lines, causing equipment to malfunction. Operators reported receiving shocks and sparks, and in some cases, telegraph paper caught fire. The event caused disturbances in Earth's magnetic field, leading to inaccurate compass readings and confusion among mariners and explorers. If a similar event were to occur today, it could have far-reaching consequences because of our modern reliance on technology. Large solar storms can disrupt power grids, satellite communications, and GPS systems, potentially causing widespread disruptions. As a result, scientists and space agencies closely monitor solar activity and work on ways to predict and mitigate the effects of such events. According to scientists, solar storms like the Carrington event happen once every 500 years or so. However, we cannot be certain when the next Carrington-level event will occur, as space weather is notoriously difficult to predict. <laughs>